गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल टूडे वी विल लर्न क्लोजिंग ऑपरेशन द सिंबॉल ऑफ क्लोजिंग ऑपरेशन द सिंबॉल ऑफ क्लोजिंग ऑपरेशन इट इज लाइक अ फील्ड सर्कल एंड द मैथमेटिकल एक्सप्रेशन ऑफ क्लोजिंग ऑपरेशन ए क्लोजिंग बी इट इज गिवेन एस ए डायलेशन बी फॉलोड बाय erosion with the same structuring element b where a is my input image b is my structuring element so in order to perform the a closing with b first we have to perform first we have to compute the dilation operation and in the dilated output we have to compute the erosion operation so how to perform this closing operation let us discuss with an example so look at the example 1 this is my input image a and this is my structuring element b again the same concept considering the shaded portion it is my, it is the part of my object pixels and the unshaded portion it is the part of the background pixels and considering the shaded portion it is logic 1 and unshaded portion it is logic 0 So now look at the structuring element B. In the structuring element B, the center pixel value it is shaded. It means it is logic one. Similarly, its eight number of pixel are also shaded. It means they are also logic one. So in closing operation, so in closing operation, let me write the mathematical expression of closing operation. It is a closing B. A dilation with B followed by erosion with the same structuring element B. So in the closing operation, first we have to compute the dilation operation. Dilation operation it means we have to keep the center of this structuring element B in all the object pixels and we have to compute the logical OR operation. So if you place the center of this structuring element b at this position then its eight neighborhood pixels which becomes logic 1 or which becomes the part of the object pixels after performing the dilation operations are this 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 okay similarly if you repeat the operation at all the object pixels you will find these are the pixels these are the pixels which earlier the part of the background pixels after performing the dilation operation it becomes the part of the object pixels so let me mark all these pixels so again this is my input image a this is my structuring element b and these are the pixels so these are the pixels which belongs to my dilated result output
So these are the result of A dilation with the stretching element B. Now on this dilated image, we have to compute the erosion operation with the same stretching element B. It means in this dilated image, in this dilated output, we have to find those pixels whose center value it is also logic 1 and its 8 neighborhood pixels are also logic 1. So if you compute the erosion operation, with this structuring element in this dilated output you will find these pixels these pixels which satisfy the erosion conditions and hence this pixel will be the part of the eroded output. So let me draw the eroded output. So after computing the erosion operation on this dilated output, this is my eroded output. So if you compare, if you compare the, the result of closing operation with the input image, with the given input image, in the given input image you can see in this object one, these are two pixels. These are the two pixels which may be considered as the part of the internal noise and after performing the closing operation you will find those two pixels which is earlier the part of the background pixels which is earlier the part of the internal noise after performing the closing operation it becomes a part of the object pixels and hence those internal noise present in this object pixels has been mitigated after performing the closing operation. Thank you.